And now I, your big old fraud reader, will read Froggy's Lemonade Stand. I might have a little drink after I read this story, so listen up and I'll get you a squeeze. It was hot. Froggy woke up and looked out the window. The sun was shining like a gold coin. Ah, he said to himself, that gives me a great idea. So he hopped out of bed and got dressed. Zip, zoop, zup, zut, 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 zat. I flopped to the kitchen for breakfast. Flop, flop, flop. Mom, he said, jumping on the chair, I'm going to have a lemonade stand. I make lots and lots of money. Good idea, says mother, but first, eat your breakfast, dear. So Froggy ate his breakfast of cereal and flies. Munch, crunch, munch, and thought about what he could buy of all the money he made. Let's see, he bought a new hula hoop, a new polo stick, boing, boing, boing. A new superhero tape, zoom. And he said, okay, time to sell some lemonade. And he jumped out and flopped outside, flop, flop, flop. Froggy, called his mother, what? First, you have to make the lemonade, dear. Oops, cried Froggy, I know that. And he picked some lemons from the lemon tree. Then raced to the kitchen, into the kitchen, and started squeezing them into a pitcher, saying, Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Ouch! cried Froggy. I swear, lemon juice in my eye. When the pitcher was full, he poured in a whole box of sugar. Zloop! Then lots and lots of ice cubes. Splat, splat, splat. And then he stuck some his finger in to taste it. Yum, said Froggy. And he flopped back outside with the lemonade. Flop, flop, flop. Only, he only splashed half of it out. Froggy, called his mom. What? You forgot to make a lemonade stand. Oops, I know that. Now, with a little help from mom and dad, Froggy made a lemonade stand. Bang, bang, bang. Then he hammered up a sign and shouted, free lemonade for sale, 25 cents. But Froggy, said Mom, how can it be free if it costs 25 cents? Oops, cried Froggy, and he drew a line for the word freeze. Free. Zwish. And he sat down and waited for his customer, first customer to come. He waited and waited and waited, and it got hotter and hotter. And every time Froggy got first, he drank a cup of lemonade. Glug, glug, glug. By the time his first customer, Frog Lena, came and said, Hi, Froggy. A cup of lemonade, please. Just to draw and strip out of the pitcher. Zblish, zblish, and all the lemonade was gone. Who's it, Froggy? And he ran off. He raced back with an old soccer trophy. One soccer trophy for sale, 25 cents. But Froggy, what we want is. Just then, Max shot up and said, Hi, Froggy. A cup of lemonade, please. Froggy ran off and rushed back with a busted saxophone. One cent of them for sale, 25 cents, but probably what I really want is... Just then, Maggie showed up and said, Hi, Froggy, a cup of lemonade, please. Yikes, yeah, said Froggy, and he jumped off, up and ran off. And dashed back with a broken baseball bat. One baseball bat for sale, 25 cents. But probably what I really want is... Lemonade! Everybody shouted, even Polly Wagalina. Oh, I give up, cried Froggy, follow me. And he led everybody back into the kitchen. Oops, said Froggy. There's no sugar left, and all the ice is melted, and all the lemons are gone. I have to pick some more, said Frogalina. I'll get some sugar, said Max. And I'll get some ice, said Matthew. Good idea, said Froggy. While Max and Matthew ran off, Frogalina climbed the lemon tree and picked lemons. And when Max came back with a box of sugar and Matthew came back with a bucket of ice, they all made lemonade together, saying, Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Then they ran outside and had a wild lemonade party around the lemonade stand. Froggy, called his dad. What? So how much money did you make? Oops, cried Froggy, looking more red in the face than green. I didn't make one cent. But we all had a great time. Yes, cried his friends. The end. Why well, I hope like this book does. Lemonade is so good. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So, 
Give me some big squeeze, a big thumbs up, and that's a lemonade. So see you later.